one is partially flat, works really well. A hard one is going to not work well. So you need a softer ball like this. And uh, I'm going to put it right there. And a, a firm upright chair works really probably the best. And you can do it in an office chair, though. And we just do this. Sometimes it's helpful to do this and relax and breathe. If you don't breathe well with this, it doesn't work as well. <sighs> it's even yeah. good to do a little bit of a chin tuck while you're doing this, yeah. too. So you bring your chin and tuck it back. Yeah. Yep. And you're right, Brad. And you can even put your hands behind your yeah. neck like this and stretch back. Get your Stretch your uh, pectoralis major yeah. over there a little bit, too. If you want to so bring the head back, that's an option. The ball, the this, is, this is really a great exercise developed by Mike, one of our, our employees. And, and it really, because it, you can put it up and down in the different yeah. parts of the back. Yeah. You can see I started high, now I'm down low, and it just feels fantastic. It really is a great exercise. It it's, it's so simple to do and just inexpensive to buy a ball like that. Yeah. Well, I just one 